I'm Peter. I've lived here in the sheltered accommodation 16 years now. Obviously, I was with my wife and she passed away with Alzheimer's two years ago. I mean, with Mary, we, we were two of a kind. Um, and she, when she passed away, we'd been married for 63 years and travelled together, worked together, always together. So it was a, quite a wrench. My name is Carol. I've been doing care for 26 years and I've worked for Loving Angels for the last two years. When I saw the name Loving Angels, I thought what a beautiful name it was for a company. I applied, they answered me the next day and I've been in the same role for the last two years. When I first met Peter and his family, I was looking after his wife Mary. After the unfortunate death of Mary, they went, we then went on to look after Peter which was really nice and to be appreciated that, you know, they enjoyed our company and we were given good care. My daughter, her husband and her two grandsons were looking after me and my wife at that time. And it obviously became too much for them and that's what made it necessary really to call on the, uh, the Loving Angels. And from there on obviously it's been first rate. I know that if I have a problem, such as I did about when, two months ago, and uh, one of the carers were here, a carer and her name is uh, Angelina, and she knew just what to do, and this was pressed, and paramedics were here within five minutes, and they put me on oxygen mask tested me and whisked me straight into Frimley. And th that was really, the beginnings of that was loving carers being there, you know. I was fortunate that they were. Peter is a very positive, caring man who enjoys life. He enjoys spending time with his family and he's made you realise that life is precious and never take life for granted. Carol from Loving Angels she comes in at lunchtime, usually prepares my lunch, and then on a Thursday, she usually does shopping. Oh, she's very efficient. She knows me now, and she knows what my sort of immediate needs are, and I'm comfortable with her, you know. The best thing about being a carer is doing something so simple, yet they appreciate it very much. With all the help that Loving Angels give me, such as meals, shopping and that, um, I don't have to physically do any of that. And so sort of afternoons are free. So in the afternoon, I like to write things and that's what I'm doing. I'm using afternoon time to write the history of my life. When I'm well enough, I like to, when the weather's presentable, to come down with my sticks and just, just walk around the garden. The most I enjoy about working with Peter is he's a very positive person. He has lots of stories to tell you and he's always good company, always laughing, always joking. Oh, to loving angels, I would say, I'm pleased that when it was being arranged, that they were chosen and I thank them for what they're doing and I couldn't ask them to do any more. <laughs>